were a lot of home runs last night, but it's entirely possible that it was the youngest fan inside Fenway Park who stole the show. Five-month-old Giovanni is now known as the Fenway Baby, and he had folks going crazy last night. When we were in the row, um, we had really great presence behind us. We had a great group of people behind us. They were super, super nice. Right around the fourth inning, they started chanting like, we want the baby. Let's go, baby! Caitlin and Antonio say this wasn't their baby Giovanni's first game, but it's certainly the most memorable so far. Dancing around, um, and I mean, we just held them up like, hey, here's my cute baby, we're dancing, and like they showed him on the Jumbotron and the whole entire stadium was like, yeah! The crowd went so wild that baby Giovanni's dance moves even grabbed the attention from the players on the field. I know uh, Hunter Renfro um, at one point had to look back in the crowd to see what was going on. And when he looked back, it was just me holding up the baby. <laughs> but fans wanted more, cheering for baby Gio to return to the Jumbotron. And they did it like four or five times, and the place was just going wild for him. <laughs> the family says they never expected their night out to turn into such a wild experience. People were talking to us about, you know, oh, the baby um, is on Twitter, it's on Instagram. Uh, there was a radio station talking about him, so he is now the Fenway baby. <laughs> He's going to have his own merchandise. Right. The parents said that they're so proud to raise him as a Red Sox fan. They say they hope to be back in the stands real soon. So keep an eye out for Fenway Baby. Yeah, it looked like he was dressed perfectly for the occasion. So his first <laughs> item could be a Baby Geo onesie with the Red Sox logo. And you know what? That bottle, Eric Fisher, that he was holding up and chugging <laughs> in the crowd last night, stayed nice and cold in the weather.